The winemakers of Rutherglen classify their musket and toke into four distinct groups, depending on their quality and age. Starting with Rutherglen, the youngest, then classic, grand and rare, the oldest. Hopping over these cobweb barrels is Stephen Chambers of Chambers Rosewood. He's going to help me sort out the difference between the classifications. Well, you'll notice it when we actually do the colours. There's a fair bit of difference in the colour when you look at them. Some of the toke in these barrels is more than 100 years old. Explain to me the difference between the four of them. They're the same grape variety, right? Same grape variety. Um, what will actually happen is they... They talk with Rutherland is, is going to be youthful, as you said before. It's going to be showing primary fruit characters. OK. Depending on whether it's the muscadel or the musket, well, then you'll get your different characters. You then go to the classic, and that's going to still have some of those primary fruit characters, but going to start getting a little bit more darkness from the aging barrel. And How much barrel. older is it? Well, that one is actually extremely old. That's yeah. got some very old material in it. So we've got wines from the turn of the last century in there. Really? But we've also got wines which are only four or five years old. Move on to the Grand. The Grand is a step up in quality, you hope. The, the material that you put in that is going to be on a higher level and it's going to be aged. You're going to start getting a lot more barrel age and you're going to get some of those uh, coffee bean and vanilla. Now, when through. you say age, you're talking about the blend is going to be aged. Yes. Well, the actual base wine... The base is, wine's going to be aged. ..is okay. going to be extremely old and the wine will have been going for a longer period of time. I move on to the big gun, which is what Chambers has become particularly fav famous for in the last few years. What am I getting out of a rare, mate? Well, I, I think you're going to get a fantastic depth of, of flavour and, and length. We look for length something that you're going to still be tasting in another five minutes. I really like Toke. You've really, you know, you've confused me because now I'm thinking I've got to buy a whole bunch more wine. Um, let's say, I mean, what, what does a rare cost me, a bottle? A rare, if you come to our cellar door, it'll cost you 250 <laughs>